So right now we have seven body bags. There's five uh, students in them. Five of the seven bags are filled with students. Two of them are child body bags. Um, so we wanted to put a face to this issue. We really did. Uh, we, I think I believe that like when people see a face to something, they're easier. They're far easier to empathize with it. So when they see that people are lying in body bags and people are, are dying from this issue, they'll start to understand that this is real. Because one of the big misconceptions of climate change is that it's going to affect us in the future, which it will tremendously, but um, it's affecting us tremendously right now. Climate change is real and people are dying um, and this is happening and we need to inform people and educate people and get more people involved to um, try to mitigate the effects of climate change. We see these storms all the time. Maria, Sandy, um, all these storms from droughts to typhoons, these hurricanes that I mentioned before, the wildfire in California, are all intensified due to climate change. And these storms are killing people. Storms that shouldn't be as strong as they are are killing people. A tremendous amount of people. And it's just unfortunate because we're doing it ourselves. So Ann Gunther had the idea, um, but then the group kind of took it on. and. Um, some of our members wrote some of the stories of the people that got into the body bags, how they died. Um, and then some of our members are actually in the body bags and everyone was a part of the conversation. Um, so we've been planning this for a couple of weeks, um, but I'm just so pleased with how it's all turned out. And um, it's really just a, a powerful um, demonstration and sort of like a, an art exhibit type thing where you can kind of just come read the stories take it all in um, and then you know sort of go on and, and think about wow okay this issue is real and you know maybe inspire some people to take some action. It's important to remain hopeful and to stay uh, ambitious and to stay uh, I'll be redundant to stay hopeful and to get uh, and to understand that we can do something we really could we're not we're not doomed we're not like just thrown out into the void for done so we're, we really can reverse our our fate. We are the Climate Action Club. We meet Mondays at 7 o'clock in Honor Center in 111. Um, we have a lot of fun. We talk. We uh, don't forget. We don't forget to smile and be a little goofy because it's very easy to get hopeless and upset with environmentalism, especially in the administration that where you have to fight our own government to protect the planet. 